I had no idea, in fact it wasn't my intent to begin with, to go specifically after pit bulls. It seemed to be kind of a national story at that time, and it was picking up some momentum. If you turn on the news, you don't hear about the menace of motor vehicles. You hear about dogs because it pushes buttons, let alone taking dogs and then finding a breed of dog. No more pit bulls in the city of Lakewood. The dogs have been banned. And I said, well, wait a minute. You guys approved this dog. You've got the email on your computer. Do you delete those? So they pulled it up and I was told, I don't really care. I've already turned them into the city. We are doing everything we can, not only to actually create safety, <coughs> but also to create the perception of safety. 911 emergency. Uh, there's a stray pit bull, uh, a white pit bull. Uh, doesn't seem to belong to anyone. Okay, I'll let the animal ward I know. All right. There's a lot of them that are never going to bite anyone, but you don't know which ones those are going to be. And they didn't miss. If they wanted your skin, they'd have got it. They're just issuing a warning. It tears friendly dogs out of their home and basically results in their death. To extrapolate that over 20-some years, it's clearly in the thousands. How can that be possible when we're only really talking about three breeds? They've been able to pick and choose based on what they think a pit bull is. Uh, appeared to be was a, a pit bull type dog. Uh, when I arrived at the scene, I verified that fact. If I say 30 seconds, that's too much time that he was there to identify Roscoe as a pit bull. That's the difference here of these dogs is, is in their breeding and their DNA. Well, a breeder would not consider them pit bulls, but they just happen to be that way. There was no evidence from anywhere in the world that regulating dogs on the basis of breed makes a community safe, safer. There simply isn't any. Let me ask you a question in response to your question. Does the fact that we have uh, gun laws prevent criminals from getting guns? This to me was just truly, truly a basic fairness question that just sort of suddenly gained a lot of momentum.